Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a brand new vlog. Coventry City away today, Saturday lunchtime kickoff at the Rico Arena. I'm also going to be vlogging this game on West Brom Fan TV. So if there's any viewers on Connor's channel, um, if you could please subscribe to my channel. We're trying to hit 800 subscribers. Connor will put a link to my channel in the description. So if you could go over there and subscribe, I'd really much appreciate it. On to the game. Obviously, we slipped into fourth place now in the Championship. Coventry occupy a place in the top six also. So it's going to be... A difficult game for us as it always is in the championship and if we're not on our own game and we make some mistakes that we have been doing recently i'm sure we will get punished i've seen a lot of times where Coventry have punished teams on championship highlights so yeah it's going to be a tough one today uh no doubt particularly away from home and our away form drought so gotta make sure we end that today and make sure we hit the back end that you know no goals come in from anybody wasted opportunities we are creating them but no one's putting them in the back end that unfortunately at some point it will click whether it will click today remains to be seen. I'm hoping it does because you really need the three points um, today to try and pressure the top two after Fulham and Bournemouth drew yesterday. That was a great game, by the way. Um, but we're going to head down to the Rico Arena now, see how the action plays out. Hopefully we can get those three points. <laughs> Go on, get your head on it! Yes! Oh! Oh. Go on!
gol. Y es. Que now. We just scared the hill. Oh, Mowat. Spice here. Shit. Let's go. So, just got back from the game, finished Coventry City 1, West Brom 2, massive, massive win that, really important to to get the three points today uh, and end that away uh, drought and put the pressure on the top two, I think it's now six points from Bournemouth and uh, special mention to Taylor Garden Hickman and Alex Mo. I thought they, the pair of them were outstanding in midfield today, really cut up the play and and, and and made us stronger defensively. Uh, we had two good central midfielders in 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 play today to to break it up. So, and a special mention to Gardner Hickman, as I say, brilliant performance from him. Um, and Carlin Grant getting his ninth goal of the season. You could tell after that goal, it was a great finish as well. Great uh, pass through by Callum Robinson. You could just tell after that first goal for the rest of the first half, we were at it with the intensity, with the pace. You know, a goal can do wonders. It's it, it's mental in football and we looked a completely different side. Second half coming out, um, I did think we were a bit too defensive minded. Um, by the way, for that second goal, I think most of the four and a half thousand travelling Albion fans thought Kipre handled that and he did. So you got to take the look where you can get it. But as I say, second half, I think we we're a bit too defensive minded. Gave the goal away. Um, seven minutes before the end and it was coming Coventry had some attacks and, and the goal was coming to be fair but we look a lot stronger defensively um, which is really good to see it's really it's really good to see some some good defending going on and we're limiting the goals going in it's just about taking the chances at the other end and again we had multiple chances to get today we could have scored five six goals you know Robinson missed a great chance in the first half um, so yeah, still got to be a bit more clinical, but looking very short up at the back, which is important to see. And the win, as I say, great confidence booster going into next week's game against Reading, which will be another difficult game as it always is in this league. Um, but yeah, confidence will be high now. The the win is back, the goals are back, um, and hopefully we can just kick on now. And you never know, pressure is a funny thing for the top two. If we can keep uh, pressurising them with wins uh, on the board, then anything is possible but still early days but very good to get back on track but guys if you've enjoyed the vlog make sure make sure to smash the like button comment down below your thoughts of country west brom and subscribe if you're new to the channel and i will see you guys for more videos very soon